Hey guys, Leo here and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 1. It's been a long time since I came here. So without wasting any more of your time, let's roll the intro and jump straight into the video. Okay, so let's go down here. Let's go meet this guy. Hello, hello. Altair, my friend. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. Whose life do you come to collect today? His name is Abuna <laughs> Kud. What can you tell me about him? Oh, the merchant king of Damas. Richest man in the city. Yeah, yeah. Quite exciting, quite dangerous. I envy you, Altair. Well, not the bit where you were beaten and stripped of your rank, but I envy everything else. Oh, except for the terrible things the other assassins say about you. But yes, aside from the failure and the hatred, yes, aside from those things, I envy you very much. I do not care what the others think or say. I'm here to do a job. So I ask again, what can you tell me about the Merchant King? Only that he must be a very bad man if Al Mualim has sent you to see him. He keeps to his own kind, wrapped in the finery of the city's noble district. A busy man, always up to something. I'm sure if you spend some time amongst his type, you'll learn all you need to know about him. I will. Where would you have me begin my search? If I were you, I'd start with the Omayyad Mosque and Souk Saruja, both of which are west of here. Further to the northwest is Salahadin Citadel. It's a popular meeting spot and has proved a reliable source of loose tongues in the past. Yes. Okay, so west and northwest, so okay. My thanks for your guidance, Rafiq. I'll return when I've gathered the necessary information. Okay. So we are going west and northwest. Okay. Okay. Let's see what are there. Show me just objectives. Okay. So this is interrogation, okay, okay. This is information uh, in form of like challenge, okay. This is pickpocket. Okay, let's Okay, let's go to the pickpocket and what is this? Okay. Let's do the eavesdropping first. Okay. The rest of it has been delivered. Good. Make sure he also knows it wasn't easy arranging a shipment like this. It's only wine. Some can be fickle in their faith. Your holy book says something on the subject, I believe. Leave them that they may eat and enjoy themselves, and that hope may beguile them, for they will soon know. And never did we destroy a town that had a term made known. What's that supposed to mean? Never mind it. Be about your business. As you wish. Okay, so who do I do I have to? Oh, okay. It's preparing a feast, okay. Let's see. Let's actually do this one then. Okay, let's just rush there. Has he lost his mind? Okay, I'm here. Hello. Okay. I have a strange request, but perhaps you'll see fit to assist me. I know you seek the Merchant King's life, but there are others in this city just as cruel. Several shopkeepers in this district have taken to selling rotten meat. It's cheap for them to acquire, and they care and little for the meat. illness that okay. it causes. Several children have already died as a result. We should not allow this injustice to continue. Okay. Would you be willing to put a stop to this? 
Yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah, dude, why not? What is it? <laughs> Take yourself. What is it that you want? Open your eyes. Okay. Sorry. Okay, I got a fight, okay, okay, no problem. Okay. Come on. Okay. okay, come on. for your kindness I'll give you a bit of information you might find useful thank you I overheard two of the merchant king's servants this morning it seems they've left some scaffolding just outside his personal quarters you could use it to reach him that much quicker okay thank you okay that will be useful okay now let's do my favorite mission that is Interrogation. Okay, let's go. Okay, done. Dude, no one is hearing you. His men tend to the fires that we might be Except me, of course. His kindness knows no bounds. Everything we now have, we have because of him. Right. The merchant king provides for one and all. Yeah. He asks for nothing in return. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let his generosity serve as an example to us all. Everyone should strive to be as he. Okay. Now let's go. Kick his ass. God curse the one who's done this. You will pay dearly for that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, die. Okay. Okay. I'll talk, I'll talk. Yeah. I've no interest in dying for him. His coin's not worth my life. A wise decision. What but you will die at the end. I have business with the merchant king. Huh? Good luck with that. He rarely leaves his chambers. Why? Is he afraid? Not fear. Hate. Hate? He hates himself as much as he hates the people he pretends to serve. What? Locks himself away in his personal quarters, out of shame. He can't stay hidden forever. No. Those celebrations of his. He comes out to speak. To look down upon the people. A sense of belonging, I suppose. However brief. What's wrong with him that he would hide like this? <laughs> You'll see. You'll now see? Let me what? Go. Let you go? No. So you can tell him of my plan? I won't say a thing. Yeah, whatever. You won't. Yeah, because you are you're not gonna be alive to share anything.
Okay, so that's gonna be when I'm gonna strike. Okay, understandable. Okay. Let's go to the bureau. Okay. Let's go. Okay, we are here. Let's... Go. Peace be upon you, Altair. Yeah. How may I serve you? I've done as asked and learned all I need to know about my prey. Then you must share your knowledge with me. Okay. Abu Naqud is corrupt to the core and despised by his own citizens as a result. It appears he's been stealing money meant for the people of Damas and spending it on himself. Even as we speak, he flaunts his greed, preparing for a lavish party. His guards and servants should have their hands full dealing with the guests. They won't even know I'm there. Most impressive, my friend. The others said you'd make a mess of things, but not I. No, I was sure you'd come through. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, come yeah. through you have. The bureau is yours to do with as you please until you're ready to begin. Fast forwarding memory to a okay. more recent one. Let's go kill this guy. Okay. He's gonna come out. I'm gonna stab his heart out. Okay. Let's begin the journey to him. Okay, we are here. Let's go in. Okay, oh. Oh. Okay, people are dancing. This is a feast of some kind, okay. Okay. Oh! He is here. Welcome, welcome. Thank you all for joining That's a fat me boy. Please eat. Drink, enjoy all the pleasures I have to offer. Take your time, I will wait. Okay. I trust everything is to your satisfaction. Most excellent, Most excellent. okay. I guess. Good, wait, good. is that wine coming out from that? So happy for these are Dark days, my friends, and we must enjoy this bounty. Every time in the dark days. War threatens to consume us all. Salah Adin bravely fights for what he believes in, and you are always there to support him without question. It is your generosity that allows his campaign to continue. So I propose a toast then. To you, my dear friends. Okay, okay, okay. May you be given everything you deserve for it. Such kindness! I yeah. didn't think it in you. You, who have been so quick to judge me, and so cruel. Oh, do not feign ignorance. You take me for a fool. But I have not heard the words you whisper behind my back. Well, I have, and I fear I can never forget. What? But this is not why I called you here tonight. No. I wish to speak more of this war and your part in it. You give up your coin quick as can be, knowing all too well it buys the deaths of thousands. You don't even know why we fight. The sanctity of the Holy Land, you're saying. Or the evil inclination the heck, of our dude? enemies. But these are lies you tell yourselves. <laughs> no, all this suffering is born of fear and hate. It bothers you that they are different, just as it bothers you that I am different. Yeah, dude, whatever. Compassion, mercy, tolerance. These words. Let me just get up there and I'll whoop your ass. Mean nothing. 
to those infidel invaders who ravage our land in search of gold and glory. And so I say, enough! I pledged myself to another cause. One that will bring about a new world in which all people might live side by side in peace. Hmm. Okay. A pity none of you will live to see. <laughs> What? Did they poison it or something? He poisoned it. Yeah, he poisoned the party. People are dying. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna try to escape, okay? I'm gonna get up there. Then I'll whoop your ass. How do I do? Okay, how do I get up there? Okay, it is. Okay. Okay, die. You won't. Actually, you won't. Get away from me. I will. Stop running. You can... Okay. Okay, what the heck? Where the other arrows coming from? Okay, oh there. I can go up there, okay. I think I can, okay. I have. Actually, I have. Okay, let's go. Okay. Now I shall go there. Okay. 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 From how do, how do I get there? Okay. He's running out. Oh, okay. Okay. He's like running away and I have to catch him. Okay, dude, no problem. Okay, die. Be at peace now. Their words can no longer do. Yeah, fat boy. Why have you done this? You stole money from those you claim to lead. Sent it away for some unknown purpose. I want to know where it's gone and why. Look at me. My very nature is an affront to the people I ruled. And these noble robes did little more than to muffle their shouts of hate. So this is about vengeance then? Okay. No, not vengeance, but my conscience. How could I finance a war in service to the same god that calls me an abomination? What? If you do not serve Salah ad dins cause, then whose? In time, you'll come to know them. What? I think perhaps you already do. What? Then why hide? And why these dark deeds? Is it so different from your own work? You take the lives of men and women, strong in the conviction that their I don't take lives of women. improve the lots of those left behind. A minor evil for a greater good? We are the same. No, we are nothing alike. Ah, but I see it in your eyes. You doubt. You cannot stop us. We will have our new world. We?
Fight right now. Not in mode. Not even a little bit. Okay. Let's run. No, I won't. Okay. Yeah, I, I didn't. Let them go, let them go. Okay. Okay. Let's get on the roof. And now let's run. Found any soldiers yet? So yeah, that's good. Okay, get down, get down, dude, get down. Okay. Word has reached me of your success, Altair. Abu Nakud's reign of terror is at an end. I'm glad to hear it. He killed them, the men and women at his party. It was poison. A coward's tool. Blamed them for the war. Said he wished to end it. Strange. But then again, the merchant king was known to be a bit... different. Perhaps this was simply a symptom of his madness. Perhaps. Okay. Perhaps. You sound unconvinced. Speak with Al-Mualim then. He may offer a better explanation. Yes. Yeah, I will. We'll see what he has to say. I will speak to him. Actually, I have to speak with him. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. Okay. Okay, let's go. I'm going to him, I guess. Oh no! We I know already. Get up. Whatever you say, Doc. What? I'm ending the session. No, I'll be right there. You're sure about this? What? Yes. No. Everything's Denver. I don't see how he could... Of course. I understand. You're in a lot of trouble, Mr. Miles. What's his problem? They're coming for you. Who's coming for me? Assassins. Hey, I what? had nothing to do with this. Sounds like they're mounting some kind of rescue attempt. Guess you're more important than you realized. Man, things just keep getting weirder and weirder around here. Yeah. It's bound to happen. What do you mean? That little fight your ancestors started during the Third Crusade? It never ended. You're being held by Templars. Vidic's a Templar? There's no way you could have known. They hide it so well. But to answer your question, Vidic works for them. We all do. Abstergo is their company. I thought Templars were old dudes with funny hats who... Sat around drinking beer and plotting world domination. Yeah, but I don't like think lizard people. No, except the part about world domination, I guess. Look, Desmond, it's complicated. Half the stuff they say about the Templars comes from crazy tinfoil hat wearing nut jobs. The other half is misinformation intentionally produced by the Templars themselves. But they are the bad guys, right? If there's one thing I've learned since I started working here, it's that there's no such thing. It's all so relative. I guess the best way to explain it is, what they want is good, but the way they're going about it, it's bad. Okay. Really bad. What are they trying to do? 
they're gonna kind of rescue Lucy. me. Yes. Miss Stillman, I need to speak with you. Get up here now. On my way, Doctor. Okay. I'm sorry, Desmond. I have to go. You should turn in for the night. Okay. The answers to all of your questions are right in front of you. You just have to know where to look. Are you sure about that? Go shower a bit, dude. You are dirty as heck. No, you can't. Okay. I'm gonna just go to sleep then. What? What was that? Okay. Where is Doc? He hasn't come to wake me up? Oh, he's there with his cup of tea. Missed you this morning, Doc. Get in the animal. Yeah, I did also. Okay. I did too. Okay. I was about to go to Almu Alim. Let's go. Use the action view to gather information about your surroundings. I guess I'll spawn there. Yeah. I trust you are well rested. Ready for your remaining trials? I am. But I'd speak with you first. I have questions. Ask okay. them. I'll do my best to answer. The merchant king of Demon murdered that again? the nobles who ruled his city. Meshdedin in Jerusalem used fear to force his people into submission. I suspect William meant to murder Richard and hold Akka with his troops. These men were meant to aid their leaders. Instead, they chose to betray them. What I do not understand is why. Is the answer not obvious? The Templars desire control. Each man, as you've noted, wanted to claim their cities in the Templar name, that the Templars themselves might rule the Holy Land and eventually beyond. But they cannot succeed in their mission. Why is that? Their plans depend upon the Templar treasure, the Peace of Eden. What? But we hold it now, and they cannot hope to achieve their goals without it. What is this treasure? It is temptation. What? It's just a piece of silver. Look at it. What am I supposed to see? This piece of silver cast out Adam and Eve. It turned staves into snakes, parted and closed the Red Sea. Eris used it to start the Trojan War, and with it a poor carpenter turned water into wine. It seems rather plain for all the power you claim it has. How does it work? He who holds it commands the hearts and minds of whoever looks upon it. Whoever tastes of it, as they say. Uh, okay. Gagne's men? So it kind of controls you? Herbs used to simulate its effects, to be ready for when they held it. Talel supplied them. Tamir equipped them. They were preparing for something. But what? War. And the others, the men who ruled the cities. They meant to gather up their people, make them like Gagne's men. The perfect citizens, the perfect soldiers, a perfect world. Robert de Sable must never have this back. So long as he and his brothers live, they will try. Then they must be destroyed. Which is what I've had you doing. Okay. There are two more Templars who require your attention. Two more? One in Aka, known as Sibran. One in Damas, called Jubair. Visit with the bureau leaders. They'll instruct you further. As you wish. Be quick about it. No doubt Robert de Sable is made nervous by our continued success. His remaining followers will do their best to expose you. Okay, what is They'll that in front of you your another sword? The man in the white hood. They'll be looking for you. They won't find me. I'm but a blade in the crowd. Here, my gift to you. In gratitude for the good work you've done. What, another sword? Am I Witcher now? Oh, 
Or is this the same one? Okay. This is the same sword, okay. Yeah, it is the same sword. New ability, okay, let's see. Okay. It takes time. Don't toss your weapons around so carelessly. Okay. You won't often get the second. Okay. Damascus and Acre. Okay. I'm gonna go to Damascus. Okay. Miru. When you're out of knives, refill your stock by returning to Messiah or by pickpocketing thugs. Okay. Back to where I was. Okay. I am back. But that's all for today. We have run out of time. And we killed another guy. A fat boy this time. So yeah, if you did enjoy this video, hit that like button. And if you want to see more of my content, hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell too. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.